Alright, this is looking at a dual core Atom N550 decoding H264 con 1080p content. Um, you can see the frame rate up in the corner. Of course, I went full screen so the CPU utilization gets higher, frame rate drops. Since this is a 3D movie clip, if it's playing at full speed, you'll see 48 frames per second. Like we've now stabilized there with less difficult content. But throughout this little clip, you'll see the frame rate drop periodically when a lot of stuff is going on. Like right there, it just drops again. So that's dual core Atom N550. Moving over here, this is a dual core Brazos E. C50. C50, sorry, dual core. So this is running at 1.0 gigahertz. Um, and again, basically the frame rate's pretty much locked in at 48. CPU utilization for the two cores averages around 20%, it would look like. So totally playable on this. And then you come over, this is your single core. C30 running at 1.2 gigahertz. Go full screen here. So again, frame rate's pretty much set. Um, CPU utilization on this one's a little higher, of course, because you only have a single core. But you can see throughout all of that, even while I was multitasking, you know, the CPU utilization didn't ever hit. 100%. We come back over to the Atom system, check this out. Hey, let's bring up your start menu, what happens? Oh, where's my CPU use? So, you start to see some spikes as you start multitasking. It does manage to play it somewhat. If you had core AVC running, it might lower your CPU utilization, but overall, you know, it's a better experience with hardware accelerated decode. So this is Jared Walton from Anontech at the AMD booth demo for CES. And you can see the temperature pictures below. Take care.